Hi, my name's Jeremy Sims and I'm the writer, director, producer of Last Cab to Darwin. Um, we're really excited to be here. The film is a love story and a road movie set in Central Australia about an old man who's diagnosed with cancer who has, doesn't have long to live and he travels across Australia uh, and gains wisdom until he can come home again and, and tell the woman he loves that he loves her. Um, what we didn't do, uh, well we, we heard the story of a guy called Max Bell who was an old taxi driver from Broken Hill who drove to Darwin to kill himself when the euthanasia laws there were passed very briefly. Uh, it was only legal in the Northern Territory for about three months until it was shut down. Um, but we decided that we liked the idea of that journey, but that was the only part of the story of Max Bell that we told. It, it, we changed the character's name to Rex, and we gave him an Aboriginal next door neighbour, and we gave him an Odyssean, like uh, the story of, of, of the Odyssey. Um, that's the, the template for our film. So really it's not a true story at all. It's inspired by the true story of Max Bell, but, but Rex McRae, the story, the, the hero of our film, is a fictional character. Well, the hardest part was, was the distances involved. Um, so his journey is 3,000 kilometres long, and I travelled that journey five times in, in researching and preparing to shoot the film. I, I did it once the first time with the writer when we, when we were first thinking about telling the story. Uh, and then I did it again um, eight years later when we decided we were going to make a film. And then I did a recce with my director of photography and some other heads of department. And then we did it again because I lost my director of photography and I got another one because I had to go with him. Uh, and then we did it once more for logistics and then we did the trip. So I've done it five times. Um, it, it's an extraordinary part of the world, Central Australia. and. I'm looking forward to going to the deserts in Dubai tomorrow morning uh, to see uh, what that's like because it's, it's a very dry, flat, red land in central Australia. It's great to be here. Thank you.